Don't forget to check out and grab your copy of our two newly released books, Football, A Love Story, and What Did Football Teach Me? These books feature over 100 stories from current and former coaches, players, executives, and entertainers from across the football landscape describing what got them involved in a game, what they love about it, and what life lessons the game taught them. You can find your copy or order your copy from our website at footballgameplan.com slash books. What we do here is go back, 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 back. Welcome to footballgameplan.com where football makes sense. I'm Emery Hunt, the czar of the playbook, bring you our 2016 NFL draft grades video for the Houston Texans. We're going to take a look at all of their draft selections as well as some undrafted free agents that you want to keep an eye on. Houston had a plan to get much more dynamic offensively, and in my opinion, they were able to accomplish that via the draft. I also like the two guys that they selected in the trenches in guard Nick Martin out of Notre Dame and defensive tackle DJ Reader out of Clemson. Martin has a chance to start for day one for the Texans and fifth round pick safety KJ Dillon out of West Virginia should also contribute nicely as a sub package player. I mentioned the Texans getting much more dynamic offensively, and when you look at wide receivers Will Fuller out of Notre Dame, Braxton Miller out of Ohio State, and running back Tyler Irvin out of San Jose State, all three were big-time game breakers with explosive speed. So look for all three guys to have immediate impacts within the regular offense and also on special teams. Fullback Soma Vinuku out of USC, in my opinion, was the best all-around back on their roster this past season. He's a fullback that can handle single-back carries and is also a very good receiver. I know they drafted Jay Proch two years ago, but look for Vinuku to make noise in training camp. The Texans didn't draft the tight end, but ended up finding exactly what they need in tight end Steven Anderson out of Cal. He's a flex player with the above-average ability to make things happen after the catch. He can be the X factor in their passing game that allow other receivers to have success because of how well he can draw coverage away from them. Arturo Adzavinis out of Tulane is an offensive tackle with some upside. He's an excellent athlete that's only in his fifth or sixth year of playing football and the Texans offensive coaches are getting a nice mold of clay in Adzavinis. Linebacker Shaquille Rashad out of North Carolina excels in space. You can trust him in man or zone coverage. You can even trust him coming off the edge as a rusher, he does a solid job as well in playing the run away from him. So I think from a versatility standpoint, he has a great chance to stick. I gave the Texans an A for their draft. They signed their quarterback via free agency and spent four selections putting talent around him. Signing tight end Steven Anderson out of Cal as an undrafted free agent was a big time score. They also added good defensive depth with Dylan and Reader. So all in all, this was an excellent job by Houston. <laughs> 